welcome ladies and gentlemen this is the energy vibration reading for the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising sign for um, the third week of January I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back let's see what is coming up for you Capricorns actually Cappy it's a wonderful week I see money coming up for you and your partner I see you come in and begin this week with celebration. The cruelty is finally over. A cycle has been ended. The tower moment where you cut down the lies and deception that has been happening. Yay, 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 Capis. I told you. Nobody mess with Capis, especially in this year, Capis. You are going to be cutting down. So the crowning of your week cap is you're cutting down and you're bringing down some lies and deceptiveness, some situation. Three times nine, something is ending in your life, Capricorns, in this third week of January. This week is beginning from the third week, the 13th until the 19th, Capricorns. You are taking down some people where I see that you are taking down a sad, um, a Leo. Whatever has transpired, you're taking down a Leo. Something, unexpected things, three things is going to be leaving your life. Some of you one, some of you two, some of you three. You got the tower moment, Capricorns, that you are seeing the lies and deception. You have the sword of truth. You're going to be waving the sword of truth, taking down a, a, a Leo. Lies and deceptive. I see that you and your partner finally is going to be overcoming some cruelty that has transpired i see you both are reconnecting in a very positive way so as we look i see um capis you're going to be successfully taking down a um a leo whoever this leo is you are going to be finding out that uh, um, and Leo or someone you have been dealing with was very, very deceptive. Someone you were dealing with was very, very deceptive. I see money coming in and a new start to your financial stability. You have the sword of truth in your hands. You're seeing the truth of, um, about an issue of a situation that has transpired. You're seeing the truth about a cancer um, yes, you're seeing the truth about cancer. You're celebrating because you're seeing the truth. I see a conflict that is happening here and it has to do with a Leo and a Sagittarius. I see a huge conflict. The truth is coming out because you, you are celebrating whatever you have done the week before you're celebrating. The truth is coming out and a lot of conflicts is here and a cancer and a Leo have huge conflicts over a deceptiveness what they have done so the truth about a cancer and a leo is coming out there it is ladies and gentlemen the lies and deceptiveness of a leo or a cancer however this is plain whether they're your friends whether they're your family the truth is here and i see that some of you a liberal could be telling you what an um what a a cancer and a leo have done and um, some of you are going to be finding out if you have friends that is a Cancer, um, an Aquarius, and a Leo, you're going to be finding out what they have done. So if you have um, friends that is a Cancer, um, a Cancer, a Leo, or a Aquarius, the truth is coming out about them and you guys are going to be successful, okay? Wow, news is coming in. I see some um, news is coming in, whatever is transpiring. I see some news coming in. A cycle is coming to an end. And this is what I said to you guys. Three times 99, a cycle is coming to an end. Nine of wands, nine of pentacles, and nine of swords in the reverse. Your worries is going to be over. Whatever that was transpiring, your worries. If you and your partner was having problems it's going to be over if you if some horrible horrible cruelty had done to you it is going to be over the lies the lies of uh, um the lies that was told is going to be coming out okay 
some of you are dealing with a Gemini and the lies that was told an Aquarius a cancer a Leo is the truth they have investigated these people and have seen the lies that has been told. News is going to be coming out that a cycle with a Virgo is also over. Some of you were dealing with it and some issues and situation with a Virgo and a Sagittarius. I see the cycle is over between you and this person. Long-term stability. I see something is being removed and new stability is going to be coming in so whatever that was blocking especially for you ladies 45 uh, 50 years and older ladies 50 years and older and this is really coming up for you guys ladies 50 years and older a cycle is over okay whatever that was blocking you whatever lies and deceptiveness and whatever that was blocking you a cycle is now over you have a strong foundation and you're going to be moving forward expect to receive some financial help i see a whole lot of money coming in expect to receive some financial help okay so what was transpiring is that uh, um your business or your financial situation was in a race because people had blocked you they had stolen from you and now the energy has been moved because you are victorious and successful and the energy is been moved whatever blocks that was blocking your financial situation the energy is moved you have long-term stability and you stand strong this is good you um latest 50 years and older is going to be receiving some money yay 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 whatever you decide to do i see money coming in for you ladies um this money is being returned if you have an issue that you were fighting for um and a house a situation that was going on fighting for deceptiveness in a corporation institution you are going to be winning you are going to be um coming out of this issue with money um your um the truth is going to be you are going to be speaking the truth uh if you are a psychic i see that whatever this week if you are a psychic you're going to be top on point you're going to be on point so if you are a psychic i see you on top on point um in this week and i see that your spirit guide is going to be helping you um your spirit guide is going to be helping you and your partner with your financial situation okay your spirit guide is going to be helping you and your partner with your financial situation the lies and deceptiveness the cruelty is now over for you capricorns whatever that there was there was some deceptiveness i see new opportunities is going to be coming out for you some of you could have uh, uh, felt the hands of a scorpion who has done you some real deceptive situation and i see now that you are no longer worried okay because whatever has transpired i see new opportunities are coming in so this worries is going to be over your double whammy is nine there is so many nines ladies and gentlemen it's as if the universe is speaking to you there's so many nines your spirit guides another tower moment came down and is uh, releasing this worries another tower moment come down and is releasing this worries and by releasing this worries you are going to be seeing multiple opportunities is going to be opening up for you guys this is wonderful the energy of the lovers is here so i see um married people you're going to be um, receiving some unexpected money love is coming in from your partner i see people are offering you love i see people are really communicating love um to you guys um especially um i see you men 40 50 years and older love is going to be coming in i see the offer of love i see you could be communicating love to a taurus virgo or a capricorn so you people 50 years and older i see you're connecting with each other and communicating 
and it's as if um, some of you ladies communicating um, uh, to a uh, a man that is for 50 years and older so you older people is communicating and I see um, that you older people however whether it's a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn I see that there is love between you two so let's say that you have a child with another Taurus Virgo or Capricorn I see that there is so much love between and uh, it's not even the energy of a child there is just so much love now men 50 years and older I see you could be getting someone pregnant men 50 years and older you could be getting someone pregnant you need to snip that dick okay some of you men 50 years and older you need to snip that dick I see you could be getting someone pregnant if you're in a relationship with a Gemini or a cancer snip that dick because you are going to be getting someone pregnant okay you are fit over 50 years and older you can't be getting anyone pregnant at this moment if someone um, said that they're pregnant for you you gotta go do a DNA test to make sure that it's for you I can't even imagine you Capricorn at this age want to have a child judgment calls some of you are going to be receiving message um, of a new start is coming in um, some of you are definitely going to be receiving message of a new start coming in and I see you celebrating this is good 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 so wonderful so a tower moment if you notice a lot of you were worry um, very much worry and I see here that whatever that was transpiring some of you were very much worried whatever was here transpiring what I'm seeing um, happening is that this worries is going to be over I see whatever that was blocking your house or blocking a situation with a house you are going to be ending up with a house I see some of you ladies could be selling a house or getting rid of a house okay um, whatever is transpiring yeah snip that dick man snip that dick especially the ones 50 years and older there's no way you sh you should be having kids now and I'm very much serious man once you are 45 years and older there is no reason to have kids after that okay because you're so old but the kid is 10 years old you're 55 I mean please seriously um, people a new offer is coming here so this is a wonderful a offer a new offer of a new start is coming up for and it's going to be affecting um, uh, a lot of you who have been going through struggles um, I see a lot of you Capricorns who have been going through struggles you are definitely going to be having and this sits in your foundation so whoever that was going through hardship and struggles that was created there are other people and um, you are going to be definitely celebrating and you're going to be receiving a new offer and you are going to be so celebrating this because you realize what has transpired and you're going to be celebrating your wow is is really really over okay your worry is really over whatever is transpiring. I see that your worries is really over to whatever that was going on and you're going to be coming out. I see um, children are going to be offering you men love. So maybe seriously, men, you know, I see some of you men, 50 years and older, wanted to reconnect with a... Um, with a with a with a woman 50 years and older that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn but you're in another relationship and whatever is transpiring you need to snip your dick because you're getting someone pregnant okay you're 50 years old there is no reason in having a child as you're 50 45 years and older what is the sense having a child seriously you need to do something about you because I see a lot of love coming in um, and that someone is going to be telling you men 50 years and older that they're pregnant they're just trying to hold you because they're looking for some money okay so be aware of that men 50 years and older 
um ladies what i see is happening is that you ladies are really just taking down things i see unexpected money is coming out for you and your partner for the people who are in relationship i see the people who are worried i see a towel moment coming in where this worries is going to be over a new start is coming from the people who were going through some hardship number 37 clean house clean house whatever is going on ladies and gentlemen clean house and this is what i'm saying to you men 50 years and older there is no reason for you to be having any child when clean house comes up it is time to clear the clutter to make way for better things so whatever is transpiring clear the clutter when you see clear house it is the time to declutter your life get rid of unwanted things in your physical home and release what you no longer want and truly need is there any unfinished business you should address through memories and emotional baggages must be swept out of your house as well your consciousness must be cleared for you to move forward and freely through the world celebrate a spring clean and feel the freedom as you make your way for much better things look at what you're you have in um, invested in and be honest about the value be honest clean house whatever the issues is the situation is clean house ladies and gentlemen wow okay ladies and gentlemen um capis my <laughs> capis it doesn't really matter what is going on you're going to be celebrating so i see some of you could be celebration is here twice i see a long-term stability is here i see people um if your business was blocked your business is going to be clearing up for pentacles four of ones this is also the energy of four of ones and it says uh, be grateful you have much to celebrate deep feelings of peace and happiness a contented personal life ladies and gentlemen capricorns i tell you one thing this is your air anyone cross your part you make sure to make them know that this year you are just not playing this year is a year that you are moving through and you're creating for yourself and your life you have no time to waste with other people and their bs it is so it says uh, be grateful for whatever you have feel that life is wonderful pride in your achievement a deep sense of peace and happiness a contented life and a new home okay so whatever is transpiring some of you are looking to buy a new home yes you're going to, it is going to be happening yes you will have the financial stability yes everything is yes gratitude is a powerful manifestation energy in this week the universe is open to help you capricorns help you gracefully dance with the magical light feetedness of the fairies take time to say thank you to the universe thank you to your family thank you to your core workers thank you to um, the source of all things every day the more you say thank you you accumulate the flow of bringing in abundance in your life every day give thanks for something in your life you can do so aloud or just in priors okay so this is new new indication um celebration is going to be coming up a lot of you are going to be celebrating um and that will soon make uh, um you feeling much better about yourself i see a social event is coming up where some of you could be going to weddings some of you could be going to housewarming parties some of you could be going to baby showers um other parties acknowledgement of a milestone in your life advancements is going to be coming up i see a couple could be getting married joining in matrimony um dancing of gratitude and admiration so there is celebration for you capricorns in this week no one can take a capricorn down i'm saying namaste until next time